hi guys welcome back to my channel if you guys hear anything in the background that is my boyfriend watching his show so i'm gonna try to get ready really really quick because we do have a lot of stuff to do today um laundry buy some stuff that i need and also i'm gonna chit chat and let you guys know update what has been going on i know a lot of you guys have not followed me on my lives what are you doing follow me on my lives i do lives basically every single day some days i don't but i usually do it every single day and i basically keep you updated with my life and everything that has to do with anything that happens to me so um before we start with this video i want to go ahead and do a friendly reminder it's okay to be negative sometimes because we all go through stuff and I know um, in my videos, most of my videos, a lot of people don't follow me because I'm very negative. But you know what? I'm not going to change that. It's who I am. I'm negative sometimes and sometimes I'm positive. Believe it or not, I am positive. Thank you, Lord, the volume. But yeah, for the majority of the time, I am trying to be positive. Um, we just moved out with my boyfriend. Uh, we've been here for a month now. As I'm talking, I'm going to go ahead and do my eyebrows. So I'm basically going to treat this as I'm doing my life. Um, so basically, just going to chit chat. Um, I do miss that I'm not going to have you guys responding. So in my lives, you guys chit chat back with me. And I like doing that. But at the same time, I'm not getting credit for it. Okay, so eyebrows of the day. Obviously, I use this this freaking liner that I bought at Temu. So you guys know the Temu website. I'm going to go ahead and link the little app right over here. Temu website sells these for really, really cheap price. Um, actually, this is bro. Uh, this is one of my favorite ones that I like to use. Um, they're very, very what's it called? Convenient. Um, basically, what it does, it creates a shadow to my eyebrows, and it just makes it really pretty. I'm only gonna do one, and then I'm gonna go ahead and just speed up everything else. But you guys will not see the speed up. I'm just gonna go like, and I'm done. You know what I'm saying? But basically, I'm gonna show you how you do one. Okay, so basically, you get your little penny thingamajig and we're basically just going to create a line from here hopefully you guys can see a little bit that's why i like to do use a mirror in the back so you guys can see so you see can you see me can you see me okay so basically you create a line from here so as you guys know i'm freaking blind i cannot see that much so right now in the background i can see myself a little blurry I do have a mirror right behind the camera, so that's the reason why. Um, some of you guys were asking, oh my god, how do you do it? How did you film just looking at the camera and doing your makeup? Like, girl, girl, it's freaking hard. Um, in the beginning when I did it, it was freaking, freaking hard and hard. So right now my eyebrows are a little slippery because I put a bunch of Nivea lotion. So if you guys don't know, I have a really, really bad skin. And I know a lot of you guys tell me, you don't have bad skin, la 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 la. I do have bad skin okay when I was younger I used to have acne like crazy and I used to get those nasty ones like the boiler ones and those were bad guys you know so basically this is what I do okay and I know it doesn't look like the best right now but all I do is just mix this um, situation upwards and I stick my eyebrow higher so you guys notice my eyebrows are really freaking thin um, obviously because I freaking pluck them like a freaking dumbass and I always do that you know like so if you're plucking your eyebrows stop right now okay so don't do that anymore because you know what I'm saying like your freaking eyebrows are gonna be thin like mine and ya no me crecen you know like they're freaking tiny y they don't grow anymore you know shade um after that we just leave a shadow so see how it looks like it's just a shadow I don't really care for how it looks like right now so after that we're gonna go ahead and grab our NYX Cosmetics Lift and Snatch. So this is from NYX Cosmetics um you know what's it called makeup launch makeup launch makeup situation I, I, you know if i forget words i'm sorry so lift and snatch um i do love this one it's one of my favorite ones and i've been using this one for a really really long time so yeah look at my skin it looks horrid really bad and if you guys don't know i've been going through a lot of shit i got into a car accident my arm got busted i'm having so much stress at work a lot of shit's going on at work and you know, so basically we just start drawing these things right here like this i'm only gonna do this one eyebrow and i'm gonna speed up the process this is gonna be a compilation by ATO. literally how long are we four minutes that's perfect after four minutes i'm just gonna go ahead and speed up the process like i said this is gonna be a blog i don't know how long this blog is gonna be i'm scared to film outside again so i don't know if i'm gonna be able to do it i'm gonna try my best because i want to give you guys obviously the very very best content and what is the best content to film in my camera stop filming in your phone girl so i've been filming on my phone this whole time and i don't get that many views so i'm also gonna try to film a cooking video today on the camera roll 
if you like cooking videos i need you to leave a comment down below right now and tell me of your favorite recipe with the ingredients i want to try to make it okay i am really freshly move out no first time renter i guess you would call it um so if you guys have some tips on how to do food so these are the eyebrows are looking they're looking really kind of natural to my own opinion but obviously if you don't like them then you don't like them you know what i'm saying um i want to tell you a little something i don't really want to spill some tea or drama here but i don't know how to feel about people that follow me right and i feel like i really talk so good of them and i really help them like in my own opinion again um i feel like we were in good terms and all of a sudden they just don't follow you who has happened that to them like girl, girl. anyways um yeah i'm not gonna say who obviously because like i said i don't wish him anything bad or whatever but i don't understand those people that pretend to be nice so basically in the sense they pretend to be fake at this point of you como dice la shari bay um, we don't have time for that, you know what I'm saying? Like, we want only but genuine people in this world. Um, but you are, we will encounter people like that. So I was just wondering about that. Like, who goes out of their way to unfollow someone? Like, I rarely have time to go out of my way to go to Instagram and unfollow them. But when I noticed that she unfollowed me, of course I unfollow her. Because I feel like I had helped her so much. And obviously, she did not become verified because of me. But at the same time, I always promoted her so much. And, you know, I actually did like her. But there were some times where I felt like she really just didn't like my negativity. And I understand that. I lost a lot of followers because they didn't like my negativity. But I'm a very honest person and genuine. And I always am honest with what I'm feeling. Obviously, my life is not perfect. I don't have a perfect day every single time, you know. And this person made it seem like she always has a perfect life every single time. There's a time where we're going to go through stuff. And we're all like that. That's what I feel. But, you know, to each their own. And, you know, wish them nothing but the best. And, yeah. But, yeah, I was just wondering. Who goes out of their way to unfollow someone? That's what, that's what I was wondering about. But this is the eyebrow. This is how it looks like. You see? I mean, hide my ugly ass face but this is how it looks like see and now we're gonna go ahead and do the rest of her face and basically the rest of the makeup right now and boom we are back guys so i already went ahead and did the rest of my makeup i obviously do look extra white i did use brighter foundation which is this one revolution i actually like this one but i haven't had the chance to buy it again i'm gonna try to go to ulta today and get all my stuff I am missing a lot of makeup, but a little update before I head out, I'm going to go ahead and cook a quesadilla for my boyfriend, so maybe you see some of that, I'm not quite sure, but let's go ahead and get our stuff ready, and I'm going to go to the kitchen now, and now you guys are going to see my kitchen. It's a different angle, guys, um, I went ahead and just flipped the camera over, um, this is the quesadilla that I'm doing for my boyfriend, it's just a regular quesadilla with mozzarella cheese and chicken. Um, we use mozzarella cheese is this one right here. We did get a membership for Costco. So this is the one that we are using Mozzarella cheese For chicken I did grab this one from the grocery store called Rouse and I did get this chicken um, We did kind of finish half of it, but like I said me and my boyfriend don't like the legs. We don't like the wings We like the breast <laughs> we like the breast assist. Anyways, that's usually what we like to eat, you know. Here's my son Keanu. Hola, puppy. Hola, mi amor. You look 3D on this camera. Look how beautiful you are, papa. I don't have anything in my hand, cut. Huh? Yeah, but my son, um, you guys don't. Oh my god, I burnt it a little bit. You gotta be careful because this is the only tortilla we have. We don't have no more tortillas. This is the last one. We need to buy more tortillas, actually. <laughs> so um, I'm just gonna turn it off, let it melt by itself. Uh, that's all I can give him for lunch. So yeah, um, the tortillas that we use for today and we basically finished them is these ones right here. Uh, we did use the Mission Flour Tortilla Soft Taco. Uh, super soft and it comes a packet of 10. Um, I already went ahead and finished everything. So why don't you just go to the trash. Uh, the kitchen, the chicken, not the kitchen, the chicken. I'm not quite sure not what to do with the chicken. Uh, we've been having this for like almost three, four days now. So I think either we eat it today or we have to throw it away. He's just, my son does like the chicken. And who's my son right here? This cute little munchkin. Let me fix this towel. 
But again, you guys, to the people that are joining or tuning into this video, um, I moved out. So I don't know if you guys know, but this is my new kitchen now. Um, I want to do a full reload of my new apartment tour. But like I said, I want to introduce you guys to absolutely everything, but um, I haven't had time, you know. Um, yeah, so this is the kitchen. I really love it. And it does have a lot of space. So let me back down a little bit. My boyfriend was there hiding. He's still shy. Oh my god, sorry about the sign. <laughs> we can't upload that. <laughs> I'm sorry about the sign. There's a sign in there. But um, uh, the kitchen does come with two lights. As you guys can see, there's two lights right here. It looks beautiful, by the way. And that's the reason why I kind of like this house way more than the other apartments. Um, but this is a full like little view of the kitchen. The kitchen is massive for an apartment. I'm telling you, I think we really, really won with this unit um, compared to the other apartments that we were viewing. The other apartments that we were viewing were like basically just half of this and then just a refrigerator. And some of them didn't even have a refrigerator. So I think we really won with that one. But the house is a mess right now. I don't want to show you the whole house yet. But I just want to show you the kitchen since I will be here most of my videos. But yeah. All right, guys, so now that the quesadilla is done, I'm going to go ahead and put in a piece of foil. We're going to go ahead and use this foil right here. And we're just going to basically pack it up in one of these. My boyfriend does not want it in his little... Um, I was going to cut it for him in pieces, but he said it's fine just in the foil. So I'm going to put the quesadillas right here. And I'm just going to go ahead and wrap it. Or this a little bit, you guys can see everything. So basically, it's right here. I don't know if there's much to show about this, but basically, it's just fold it. Yeah. like that basically <laughs> next quesadilla my boyfriend does want hot cheetos so we are going to go ahead and pack him some hot cheetos uh, we get a little ziploc bag like this one and then get your hot cheetos boy why are you sitting literally right next to me Loco. and like i said we did get a membership from costco so i have this ginormous bag of hot cheetos <laughs> Um, I know I we decided to buy the big bag because we noticed that we bought a regular size big bag of hot Cheetos and we demolished that in less than a week. Um, if you guys don't know, me and my boyfriend both love hot Cheetos. So here's the crunch. Yum. <laughs> All right, so we're just gonna go ahead and open this and put some hot Cheetos in here. It's easier to do a small bag, but with this one, it's a little harder because it's a big bag. So I'll try to pour some in here. It might be messy. So it's a big bag. Oh. That might be just enough, I think. Maybe. I think that's enough. And I use this to clamp my hot Cheetos. So yeah, a little update, guys. I did, um, to the people that don't join my lives, I was in an accident. Um, unfortunately, I only got a little bit back. Um, the guy that I had an accident with, he got like over 1K. And his car was old as fuck. So I don't know why I only got $200. And he got $1,000. But I think it's because, obviously, most likely it was my fault. Um, but yeah, so basically, hot Cheetos and quesadilla basically it um i don't think he's gonna use this you don't want to use this oh and then i'm gonna get, give him two little cuties no, two good ones actually i'm gonna give him two little cuties pelotas <laughs> two little cuties and i'm gonna give him a water ring so but i'm gonna put in a little bag so like that he could throw the trash in here you know for like his little cuties and these are so good, guys. If you guys haven't tried them, they're so good. They're called cuties. And Okay, so water, his cuties, and his actual food. I'm going to go. I don't know where he's going to put it. Where are you going to put it? He's so shy. Oh, my God. He can't even talk on camera, guys. Oh, in your backpack? Okay, boys. So, yeah. <laughs> so, this is his food. He's going to be ready to go, guys. And I have to go drop him off now. Ah. Do I look okay? I think I do. And yes, guys. So that's basically um, a little mini blog of me waking up and on a regular daily basis of day off. My arm still hurts, by the way. So again, if you guys don't know, I 
busted my arm really bad and i was working like that at work so when i decided to go to work on sunday of last week i got into a car accident it was really minor i was going like what three miles an hour and then i ended up just i thought he had turned so when i turned left to make sure cars were not coming i went for it but i didn't notice he was still on the curb and i hit him so that's what happened but um the case is closed we settled they settled for two hundred dollars and they gave the other party one thousand dollars so i don't know why that because it's called this car was so old and literally my car was more busted than his but probably because i was the one that hit him so be careful guys when you're driving if your hand is busted don't drive but i guess you guys thank you so much for stopping by um this is the first vlog of hopefully of many 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 um have a beautiful day i'll see you guys really soon in the next video bye my loves <laughs>